Hey guys, it's Catherine from 85th and Pine. And in today's Inkscape video, we are touching base on some more path options. And this will be difference and exclusion. I have this elephant icon that I uploaded. It's an SVG icon. And I also put the star and the word elephant in here as well. So first I'm gonna go and talk about difference. So difference is up in the path tab up here on the, up, on the upper left-hand corner right here, difference. So anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and select my elephant icon and I'm gonna also select my star. So to do that, you can hold down shift and select the star as well. And let's just say that I wanted to cut part of this elephant out with the star that is overlapping. So I can place the star wherever I want to, but I'm just gonna put it right here just to show you how it works with difference. So again, select your star, hold down shift, select elephant, then go up to path and select difference. So as you can see, that's what it did. It cut out the portion of the elephant that had the star overlapping it. If I were to put a no fill color on there and select a stroke color, just to show you, it would still look the same. Everything is still connected. It just cut out that portion of the elephant with the star overlapping it. So that's just something to know in case you need, need it for a project. Now, if you wanted to do exclusion. We're going to just put the star off to the side now. So I went ahead and just typed in elephant just for an example. And I'm just going to put it halfway on, halfway off the elephant icon. Now I'm going to have this selected, hold down shift, select my elephant icon, go up to path again, and select exclusion. So now, as you can see, it made it halfway different. So the part inside the elephant is kind of cut out of the elephant and the part hanging off the elephant is still showing the text as it should. So that's another thing to know in case you need to know it for a project that you're doing. So again, that was path with the star, we did difference and with the elephant text, we did exclusion. Hope that was helpful for you. If you need some more ideas and helpful tips, please feel free to join our new Facebook group called Students of the Forge. That's linked in the description box below. If you're also interested in buying your own Glowforge machine, please feel free to use my referral code, code that's listed in the description box below as well on where you can get money off. Plus I would get credits too, which mean my family truly, truly appreciate. Again, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next video.